Jason from Bohemia Bees, how you all doing? I'm in the apiary today and I wanna to show you a pretty unique behavior that bees do that most people don't have a, a strong enough explanation for. Most beekeepers have theories. Uh, there's been some studies on what the purpose of it is. Uh, we all know that bees have a job. We know that from the day they're born to the day they die, they have a job, right? So let me show you this behavior and I'll tell you what it's called and what we think it is. And then maybe in the comments below, uh, put what you think it is. Or if you're a beekeeper and you've read some articles or publications on maybe some more explanation related to it, I just think it's very fascinating. Okay, so we've got three colonies here. As you can see, both of them, all three of them are abuzz. They're very active like many of the other colonies in the apiary. Uh, this is just one of our yards. We've got a couple yards. But I want to share with you this particular scenario. This is a, a test. As you may recall, we have a video that we did where we installed three packages the exact same day from the same stock. And we are watching them, we're maintaining them. We have another video coming up. So make sure you hit the subscribe button down here in the corner so you can catch that video um, and you can see the follow-up to that. And I'll put a link in the description to the first video when we installed these bees. But what I want you to look at is, is something interesting. There's something different about these three colonies. Granted, there was a little difference in our test in order to actually make these colonies uh, to see what they would do different. But what I find fascinating is all these bees on the front of this blue one. What the heck is going on? Let's take a look. Okay, so this is what's called washboarding. At least this is the definition of what it's called. And washboarding is sort of that uh, unique behavior that bees do. You can see what they're doing. They're rocking back and forth, rocking back and forth on that, on that bottom board and that front entrance. The explanation for washboarding by most beekeepers is that they're cleansing the hive. They're keeping the hive clean. They're kind of doing, but I, I have to ask a further question as to why. Why aren't these bees cleaning the front of their hive? Why aren't those bees cleaning the front of their hive over there? Why are only these bees cleaning the front of their hive? Interesting question. Well, here's our theory at Bohemia Apiary. These bees are all a buzz because they have a job. They have a job when the day they're born to the day they die, whether it's maintaining the brood, being a nurse bee, being a comb builder, or at the end of their life, being a forager. These bees, we believe, our theory is, they're in between jobs. They don't have a specific job. There either doesn't need to be comb built, there doesn't need to be an entrance guarded, there doesn't need to be an, any more nurse bees. Uh, and if we open up this colony, you'll see there's a good volume of bees doing all those jobs within the hive. So what are these bees doing then? Well, they're kind of in between jobs. They're not quite ready to be foragers yet. And they're not quite, they're too little too old to be some of the other jobs that they do earlier. So what they're doing is they're taking their time to go out front, keep out of the brood's nest, keep the, keep the actual brood nest unclogged uh, from unnecessary bees just hanging out, right? And they're doing uh, a cleansing. That is, uh, it is some sort of a form of cleansing. They're kind of, you know, surfing, surfacing the, uh, the front of the hive. There's some, also some theories that when they're putting propolis on the front of a tree cavity, where they're actually uh, working uh, or living, that they will go out and they will wear down the surface of that to be able to prep it for that propolis. Uh, and that may be another part of that, that the process. But again, it's just a fascinating thing for us to take a look at. And if you're, um, if you're interested in bees like we are, we really like um, to look at these behaviors and try to study them, understand them. But put in the comments below what you think is going on here. And, you know, it's called washboarding. We have a theory, but there's a lot of other explanations out there as you know you ask a, you know one you ask a beekeeper or ask a few beekeepers a single question you'll get multiple answers back as many people will say so i appreciate everyone watching make sure you do us a favor and hit that subscribe button at the bottom we love to publish content out but you need your help doing it in order to do that we need to grow the channel continue to get the audience large so hit that like button share the uh, video comment below subscribe to the channel all those things really help us out as we grow our channel and continue to produce great content for interested beekeeping parties or beekeepers, new beekeepers or experienced beekeepers that like to hear different opinions or versions of, of what other beekeepers are doing. So thanks a lot for the support. Um, and I appreciate it. And, uh, we'll look for you seeing you in the next video. Uh, so remember here at Bohemia Apiary, beekeeping is definitely more than a hobby. It's an obsession.